is very humble. Yeah, that's our little office space. You know, we like, um, when we tell them when they come in this room, they not allowed to let off. It's a room of peace, no matter what's going on. So we keep them going. Our goal is to get our kids because um, I like to say, this is a historically black high school, guys. <laughs> we not. All right, thank you. Yep, we're on our way down now. Thanks. Bye. So what are some of the things that y'all go through that are, that are traumatic and stressful? A, and then B, what are some of the ways that you cope with the things that you go through in your life? So it could be positive ways, negative ways. I need y'all to keep it a buck. Okay, so that's your coping strategy? You said you sleep it off? All right, so you play the game? I listen to music. As soon as I turn the camera off, you said that. All right, nah, but okay, nah, I heard two things that like I really want to I wanna talk a little bit deeper into, right? I heard two things that like I really want to I wanna talk a little bit deeper into, right? So you said somebody in here said they popping zannies. And I and I listen, listen, I understand that you were probably playing. You were being humorous about it. I get that, right? But though you may have been playing, right? There's some people who not playing. Like, that's really what they do. Being real, why are y'all peers, people y'all age, doing zan? Alright, so so because life is hard, right? How how is popping the Zan gonna make life a little bit easier? Do you think it is? Take you away from the world, the world for a second. You don't be stressing no more. Getting gassy too. <laughs> so I'm assuming that you're talking about marijuana. Yeah, I smoke. I know somebody who smokes. I smoke. I ain't gonna lie. Very honestly, what are some reasons that you think people smoke weed? Let's talk about it. Why do some people smoke? Besides to get to relieve stress. Yeah. Yeah. Why do they feel like you're 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 what are some stressful things that you think happen to other teens, maybe, if it's not you and you do it for pleasure? What do you think are some stressful things that happen to teens that might cause them to go to some of these other things? We are like that. So how many of y'all know somebody... If not you, that is your age that experienced like homelessness. Nowhere to go. Yeah, nowhere to go. Couch surfing. Couch. It's a lot of that going on. Yeah, it's different ways of being homeless. You ain't got nowhere to send your mail. Nowhere to wash your clothes. Are you always talking about all sleeping on somebody's Yeah. Oh, you got one bag? One pair of deep, one pack of deodorant, two brushes, two face. Just trying, like you know, you just have to figure out what you're gonna do next. So you said that person is a bum. Who said that? What what makes them a bum? What what makes somebody a bum though? You ain't got no job. Okay, okay, okay. Don't take care of your kids. Okay. Don't pay your rent, bro. Hold on, cousin in the back. Uh, <laughs> you ain't got no job, you ain't got nowhere to live, you ain't got no food. You smell mad. Well, seriously, this is not a real session. This is definitely in a real session. This is session. not a real session. This is some people's life, like eviction. Some kids live with their mom, get evicted, and they all be homeless. That don't mean they a bum. That mean that they have unfortunate events. So, yeah, so y'all teenagers, right? How many of y'all decide how much money y'all parents make? Raise your hand if you if you control how much money your parents make. Okay, okay. All right. Another question for y'all: How many of y'all control where y'all parents decide to live? Oh, okay. All right. So if your parent becomes a bum, how many of y'all had control over that? Right. But that's their choice, right? But who got to suffer the consequences of that? So, do you think it makes sense to come at one of your peers, somebody who just in the same got the same amount of power as you do, for being a bum? When they not in control of how much money their parents make, where their parents decide to live, and the choices their parents decide to make. Y'all ain't control of that, right? So, why y'all gotta be responsible for that? Does it make sense to call your peers a bum? Have you ever thought about it that way? Okay. I mean, I don't know. 